hi guys <laughs> welcome back to yet another video today woo, it's a rainy day right here in the village i wonder why it never rains in january but woo, to my shock it is raining like it's january but it is raining which is kind of weird anyway so i just wanted to come outside and feel the rain the cold rain <laughs> unlike in the philippines where when it rains the rain is it's kind of warm because of the hot weather right now the rain is cold on my face although i might catch a cold or i might get sick or something but you know it is worried so anyway you guys so if you're new here my name is cherono and i'm coming to you live from my village right here in kenya okay so yeah this is my dad coming home <laughs> At least my dad is strong enough to even drive. That's wonderful news. You are going to be so Oh, Sawa. Hello. May we rob that? Can you not go to the house? I'm going to go to the house. So, guys, a lot of calves were given birth. So, look at this one, it's beautiful. Such a cute calf. It's just a few days old. Look at it big over there. Look at that. I think, I think this one is a week or two old. No, weeks. So guys, what I want to do right now is cover this up because this is firewood as it is. Look at this. This is going to be used as firewood. It's very good when lit on fire. It's very nice. It's, yeah, so I need to cover it up. So guys, we have a lot of structures in our home. This one is our old store this one i grew up seeing this like so there's base stocks inside there and stuff see and then that one is also another tractor that i grew up seeing and uh, i grew up in this house yeah this is just a structure for putting this see these maize stocks it's put here here you see that way it's dry look see so this one was for last year now it's over now we are going to begin new ones and uh, this one is a house for for the sheep it's not goats it's sheep So this is where they sleep at night. Woo. And also here these calves that were given birth recently. Now they cannot be rained on. See? It's a lot. So these are now are just a few days old. It's a bit dark in here. So that's why they have to stay here. That way they are not rained on. Unlike those ones, that means those are a couple of weeks old. That way they can stay there. This dog likes to follow people around. Guys, <laughs> uh, and that one, this one is a dog house. This is where this dog stays. This one, Rex, stays there. And uh, those houses over there that you see, those ones, those mad houses are for the workers, the people that help us around, okay, in the farm. And uh, yeah, so that is where they stay. It's their homestead. These ones are the houses that were given, that were being used long time ago and we kept the tradition going. So those ones are for the, for the people that help us around okay especially those ones especially in the farm all right so 
This is one of the cow that just recently gave birth. I don't know, is it giving birth? And see, that is my mom's firehood. Look at those, they are supposed to be picked and taken home. And the weather is not so good, guys. So on that one, that one there over there, that one. Let me, guys, I think, let me finish what, guys, I wanted to give you a tour of this other side. You know, that is our dairy. But I, I realized, you know what? <laughs> let me not. I will do it another day on a normal, on a good day that it's not raining, it's not cold. When the sun is shining, I will come and do a tour of, you know, let me just give you, I will give you a brief tour of our land, okay? So that you see how big my village is or how small my village is. So right now, I just want to go and get a few of those maize stalks and then cover it up because it's raining and it is important to keep it dry because when it's wet, the smoke, the smoke, it cannot, you cannot even survive in the kitchen because of the smoke. So anyway, let's go do that real quick and then uh, see what else we can do this evening. It's about five, it's five, almost 6 p.m. So I want to finish up this video before the the darkness arrives, okay, before the darkness lands, before the darkness, they say that, before it gets dark. <laughs> I didn't actually intend to do this, but then when I came outside and I realized, oh, oh the weather is not so cool and, you know, just uh, some idea struck in my mind. I was like, you know, why not? So let me go get, put, uh, let me go cover the maize stalks and then continue this video. It's funny how it was just drizzling right now and my jacket is even wet and now the rain has stopped so whew, it is already so me I'm done actually covered part of that forgot to show you covered part of that simply because the polythene bag is small it's not big enough for to cover the all of it so yeah so that's it so right now it's uh oh, i'm about to go and see what we are going to have for dinner and then so evenings are literally so like boring as this it's almost the same routine so maybe one of these fine days i'll show you my evening routine so you see because it's similar but anyway so let me go and see what is being done for dinner and then talk to you guys in a few. So guys, you see this? This is ghee. I just cooked it earlier, prepared it earlier. So I just want to sieve it here and then I'll show you the process. Because it's already dark inside. Come close, show them what I'm pouring. So one man of the
guys, I don't know how many of you are from Nandi community or Kalenjin community. Why you still make this? This is called, this is, uh, Coronet, Coronet, come close, see it here. That is Coronet. And this one is Kamaek, Kamaek, see, 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 see. This is a lot of kamaek. So, if you are from the Kalenjin community, especially those people with, uh, you can still do this. Then I know you're salivating right now. But don't worry, I'm going to test it for you. <laughs> we were children. We used to fight for this kind of, for this career. Like, we used to fall in line. Like, if it's me today, then the next time it's another person. So, anyway, I'm going to test it and then. This one goes very well with Ugali and Filipina. <sighs> Let me stand for this one. Okay. Guys, if you are from the Kalenjin community, then you understand how I feel right now. I cook this by myself. I wash the cream and prepare this by myself. So this is the product of this. So comment down below. Let me know. Have you ever tasted this? Have you tried it? Have you seen it? Have you tried it? How does it taste now? And that when was the last time you tried it? Wow. I'm sure even the person behind the camera is salivating for this one. This one, if you catch it with... Uh, <laughs> I'm using direct translation, but... If you use this, if you get this with uh, a bit of vegetables and ugali, believe you me, you're going to lick your fingers. So anyway, thank you for watching this video. This was just a random evening. It was raining. I've done a few, of th a few things. So anyway, <laughs> let me know what you think about the video or what you think about it down in the comment section remember to like the video and subscribe if you haven't already i mean you don't want to miss out on any of my village series it's going to be late and next time guys when i prepare this i'm going to begin with you from the word go like from zero from stage zero to the last stage okay i've just shown you the last stage but next time i'm going to show you from one the first stage to the last one so anyway so thank you for watching i will see you on my next one premier gang i appreciate you and See you next time.